Well, hello there. Thanks for joining us. In this video, we're going to be talking about how to immigrate to Canada. But before we do that, remember to hit the subscribe button below and also to check us out at our website at www.go.gooselaw.com. Stay tuned. Hi there, my name is Donovan Francis. I'm a Canadian immigration lawyer and I help skilled workers who are inside Canada and outside Canada who want to become Canadian permanent residents without having to deal with all the complicated immigration forms that are part of that process. In this video, we're going to be talking to you about how to immigrate to Canada. Broadly speaking, in order for persons to immigrate to Canada, you would need to either be a temporary resident or come to Canada as a permanent resident. In order for you to come to Canada as a temporary resident, you would either need to apply uh, for a study permit to allow you to come to Canada as an international student who would be studying in Canada, or you can apply for a work permit, which would allow you to come to Canada as a worker, somebody who would be living and working in Canada for a set period of time. So that's the temporary resident option uh, for persons wanting to immigrate to Canada. Alternatively, you also have the option of coming to Canada as a permanent resident. In order for that to happen, you would need to apply under one of several uh, permanent residency options that the Canadian government has in place. Uh, one of these options is the Canadian skilled worker option, which targets uh, people who are professionals, who have at least a, a degree and who perform certain types of job uh, duties and who are experienced uh, in certain areas of of work. So that would be the Canadian Skilled Worker Program. That's one option. Another option is the Canadian Skilled Trades option. And that's typically an option that's available to persons who are in uh, the trades, highly skilled in trade type jobs. That's another option. A third option is for persons who want to apply through one of the provincially managed immigration channels. These are known as provincial nominees or provincial nomination programs. So those are three broad categories that allow for you to become a Canadian permanent resident uh, should you choose to do so. A fourth option is for persons who are related to a Canadian permanent resident or citizen, an eligible Canadian permanent resident or citizen. And this typically um, is available to persons who are the parents or spouse or dependent child of a Canadian uh, permanent resident or Canadian citizen. So in a nutshell, those are the options that are available to persons uh, who want to immigrate to Canada. That is how uh, you immigrate to Canada. And so what are the next steps? Now that we've outlined the options, the next steps are we're going to be inviting you to go ahead and check us out at our website at www.go.gooselaw.com. And also, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel below. I trust you found this uh, video to be useful. Thanks for joining us. See you again.